Invites Hollywood Wrap, a film festival that honors the past. There are silent movies with live musical accompaniment and some forgotten films. Here's George Parakia with more. And this looks like a lot of fun. It's a yearly celebration of Hollywood's past, and it's in the very near future. Later this week, we'll see the kickoff of the 48th annual Cinecon Classic Film Festival. Harold Lloyd in Hot Water is one of the dozens of rare and recently restored films on the lineup for Cinecon 48. Film students love to watch Harold Lloyd films. We reach out to a lot of the local schools to get film students here to see these films on the big screen. I think it makes all the difference in the world. We're going to be running films that haven't been seen, in some cases, since they were first seen in theaters. Brian Cooper and Stan Taffel are two of the driving forces behind Cinecon. Among this year's choices, some classic comedy from Laurel and Hardy. Those films have every reason to be seen today and never get a chance to. And that's why UCLA is taking the time to preserve as many of the original camera negatives as possible. Among this year's festival honorees, Carlton Carpenter. <laughs> plus Phyllis Coates and director Richard Baer, who made the old Joe McDoke shorts together. Joe McDoke, is there anything you do in a hurry? Richard Baer was directing her in these shorts way back when. They have not seen each other in like 50 years. So we're reuniting them. <laughs> They're also honoring Jane Withers and Marcia Hunt, who made Gentle Julia in 1936. Both will attend. Well, I think we should make some notes. So will honoree Samantha Egger, who starred with Cary Grant in his last movie, Walk, Don't Run. We do this festival for five days a year, but it takes 12 months to put on. And the Egyptian theater is like the best venue you can imagine in Hollywood. You're seeing classic films in a theater that's been around since movies began. Cinecon 48 runs Thursday night through Monday afternoon. For more information, visit the See It On TV link at abc7.com. Best of all, it's affordable. Yeah, it's like, sounds like a lot of fun. George, thank you. Sure.